What's driving IoT are these big macro changes in the economy and socially. So the desire and the need to increase economic growth and productivity and themes like decarbonization of the economy and the aging population are driving big, big steps forward in digitization of the economy. So we have digital transformation. Digital transformation can't happen in isolation. It can't happen purely in the connected intelligent edge. It can't happen purely in the cloud. You have to think about it as a system-wide problem and optimize across the system. Qualcomm brings tremendous strengths in the connected intelligent edge and in understanding how systems operate. But to be able to optimize those systems for the use cases that are required by the industries we want to transform, we have to forge really deep relationships with the companies that fundamentally understand those spaces. This whole idea of decarbonization of the economy is creating a lot of complexity in the electricity grid. For example, now we see local generation of power and we see with the electrification of transportation a very different demand on the electrical grid. That, that change in demand means much more instrumentation, much more intelligence put at the edge. This connected intelligent edge is making, is a key ingredient to the modernization of the grid. And Qualcomm is working with companies like Gridspertise. Gridspertise is a subsidiary of ENEL. We're creating the technology that allows us to accelerate that digitization of the grid and fulfill the objectives in decarbonization. In the retail space, we're creating technology that allows, at the edge, pricing to be adapted to improve efficiency of picking goods off shelves and overall increasing the consumer experience whilst reducing the amount of labor that's required. An important part of increasing productivity in factories is to enable very easy reconfiguration. To reconfigure a factory, you want to remove wires from that factory, but you still, of course, need to be connected to the cloud. So the edge needs to have its intelligence, but also needs to be connected, and needs to be connected in such a way that there's low latency and high reliability communications. For that, 5G is a critical ingredient. By creating a 5G network in a factory, we can support protocols like TSN, time-sensitive networks, and we are working with Bosch Rexroth and demonstrating here at the show, a continuation of work we demonstrated in 2019, a, a way to have a 5G connectivity throughout the factory and achieve those productivity goals we talked about earlier.